In Thai they say when you bring your mind to the meditation, you're lifting your mind. Yokchit. In other words, trying to lift it above the affairs of the day, lift it above the affairs of the world. What does the world have? Gain, loss, status, loss of status, praise, criticism, pleasure, pain. That's pretty much it. And yet these are the things that drive people around. These are the things that people go running after. We go spinning around like this and end up not going anywhere much at all. Keep coming back to the same old place where we're dissatisfied. And then we go spinning around again. So the solution isn't to keep on spinning faster or spinning in a new way. It's to lift yourself out of the spinning around. Provide yourself with a sense of well-being, a sense of solidity inside that doesn't have to depend on wealth or status or praise or outside pleasures. You've got your own internal pleasure right here. That way you can stop spinning. And when you stop spinning, you can get your bearings. Most of the time, if we're spinning around all the time, we get dizzy. We don't know what's north or south, east or west. In other words, our sense of right and wrong gets all screwed up. But when you can stand still, then you can see, okay, these are the directions. This is where the North Star is. You figure out all the other directions from that. It's a lot easier to understand what the right thing to do and say and think will be. So try to lift your mind here to the breath. You're substituting a lesser form of pleasure, the, the pleasures of the senses outside, for an internal pleasure. It doesn't have to depend on things outside being a certain way. But it does depend on getting the mind trained. So you work on it. This is what mindfulness and alertness and ardency are for. To get the mind in good shape so that it can stay lifted up like this. And that go running back to greed and distress with reference to the world. So lift your mind and keep it up on a high level. That way, as the world spins, you don't feel like you're being caught in the spinning around. Because the way the world spins is like gears in a machine. They have teeth. If you're not careful, they pull you in, pull you in, pull you in. So try to stay on this heightened level as much as you can. And as the world, it can spin around, but you don't have to go spinning with it. You can maintain your equilibrium. And as the Buddha pointed out, if you maintain your equilibrium, it's a lot easier for other people to maintain theirs.